right, uh, basically this video is just a quick tip um, from a trouble that I had when I first started using Cubase. Um, and the, there didn't appear to be any videos or going through forums. It was just, I hate doing that, going through forums, because it's just reading and reading. And most of the time you don't find out what the problem is. Um, now with Very Audio and uh, the uh, Media Bay not getting feedback you know as in when you click on it or you click to preview something and uh, it doesn't there's no sound so uh, basically as an example <clears throat> I mean here you know so you would expect when I'm moving this note for it to um, play back that's what you want um, so first thing is this acoustic pitch back pitch feedback Click on that. Oh no, there's still no sound. So basically, what I then found out what the actual issue was, if you go to devices, and then into VST connections, or F4, and then here is the culprit, the control room. So if you disable the control room, and then cross off of that, and then go back into your audio source. I'm oh, hello. So as you can see, that is what the problem was. So um, I mean, this is just from a song that uh, what's it? Me and my mate wrote, Auburn Lewis. So uh, here. Yeah. Just a little preview there, <laughs> but yeah. So um, just a short video on uh, showing you how to do that, and obviously if we go into Media Bay. Um, Oh, wrong one. Oh, let's press F5. Uh, so. Ooh, baby. So it's the control room. You need to go into devices and VST connections and make sure this is disabled. Thanks for tuning in and please check out my Facebook page, Dale Paul Fisher Productions. Like it and subscribe.